since most of you will thankfully never dive deep enough to see these crazy creatures, we made a list of them so you could freak out about them from the safety of your home. Number 10. Fangtooth Whenever you see a fish like this, you know it's gotta be from Australia, because that's just where the devil keeps all his pets, right? Like seriously, some of the most poisonous snakes and spiders call the place home. Well, this fish is not big enough to bite your head off or anything, but as you would have figured from its name, its teeth were sure designed for that job. So, how big is this vampire fish? Well, it can only grow up to be around 6 inches in length, which is big enough to bite your finger off. And what's it called amongst the scientists? In 2020, it was said that the fangtooth could be considered an ultra-black fish. Why? Because it absorbs 99.5% of all the light that touches its body. But if that wasn't creepy enough, they have one of the largest teeth-to-body ratios of any fish in the ocean. Their teeth are so big compared to their body that they've evolved to accommodate them in special sockets near their brain. But don't worry, since they live in a no-sunlight zone, they can't harm you. Maybe. Number 9. Deep Sea Blob Sculpin Okay, so this guy, he's not even evil, but gets a bad rep. The Deep Sea Blob Sculpin, also called the Blobfish, looks very different in its natural habitat than it does when we catch it. So what goes wrong? You see, it lives almost 3,000 meters below the US West Coast, so at that pressure, it looks just fine. But when you bring it out to above sea level pressures, it turns into, well, a blob. And you know what's hurtful? It was even dubbed as the ugliest fish by the internet at one point. The blobfish had its star moment after pictures of this fish went viral on the internet and quickly became a meme online. Creepy or not, the blobfish sure is weird. Number 8. Giant Squid now, if the size of this thing wasn't enough to creep you out, what we're about to tell you sure will. Can you guess what the hunting technique of this 42 foot long squid is? Well, these squids can hunt their prey that's 30 feet away from them by shooting their feeding tentacles and catching them. But their prey isn't just other creatures. Some scientists believe that these giant squids might be cannibalistic. And how does it eat its dinner? You see, the giant squid doesn't have a normal tongue. Instead, it has something called a radula. The organ behind its beak is covered with over seven rows of sharp teeth. Good luck getting that image out of your head. Number 7. Giant Isopods you know what's worse than isopods? They're giant versions. And how large can they be? There are around 20 species of giant isopods, and most of them can grow up to just under 3 feet in length. Not only are they pretty freaky to look at, but they also have freakier eating habits. These carnivorous creatures can go years without having a single bite to eat. They can be found in cold waters of the Indian, Pacific, and Atlantic Oceans. Although they're not really dangerous to humans, their appearance makes it pretty hard not to be creeped out by them. Number 6. Giant Spider Crab Are you scared of spiders? Well, now you'll be scared of them even when you're in the ocean, because let us tell you about the giant, yep, we said giant, spider crab. Although they're not exactly spiders, their long legs make them look like arachnids. But unless you take a thousand feet dives in the ocean, you probably won't have to deal with them. They're usually found in Japan and are locally called Tall Legs Crab, which, as you can see, is a very fitting name. And just how long are they exactly? Over 12 feet. And on top of that, they weigh over 40 pounds. But as hellish as they seem, their population is declining, and efforts are being made to preserve these creatures. Number 5. Giant Grenadier While we're on the topic of giant sea creatures, let us tell you about the giant grenadier. But you shouldn't be scared of them, they don't bite or sting. But then why are they creepy? Well, if looking this creepy wasn't enough, they have a secret weapon. They stink. Literally. You see, they smell like urine, sweat, and terrible breath, all mixed together into one fish. So how do they manage to rock this nightmarish scent? This smell comes from a compound called TMA, and this fish has a lifetime supply of it. Not only that, but they also make up over 15% of the known population in the deep sea. So if you ever go to the no sunlight zone, it would be pretty easy to encounter one of these, unfortunately. Number 4. Gulper Eel this eel looks less like an eel and more like, well, just a giant mouth, if we're being honest. They can grow up to be over 3 feet in length. And do you know what's worse? Its mouth is always loosely unhinged, just waiting for an unsuspecting fish to get close enough, and as soon as a fish is near, the gates of hell itself open wide for the unfortunate fish to be engulfed by the gulper eel. And no, the prey doesn't have to be smaller than the gulper eel, because these bad boys can eat fish bigger than their own size. 
If having a mouth bigger than its body wasn't creepy enough, it also has a luminous organ on its tail that helps it see where it lives in the no sunlight zone. So then where do you go to avoid them? Well, they live in warm waters, around 1700 feet beneath the surface. But since only a few have ever been spotted by humans, you don't have to worry about encountering these creatures. Well, except for in your nightmares. Number 3. Humpback Anglerfish Speaking of deep sea creatures that have luminous body parts, how can we forget to talk about the most famous of them all? The humpback anglerfish has been the inspiration for countless creepy creatures in children's movies. But what's so attractive about them? The strange antenna on their head. But it's not just for show, it's used to attract prey and see in the otherwise dark environment. They live around 6,000 feet under the sea and are found all over the world. The anglerfish is also known as the humpback black devil and can swallow prey twice its own size. Speaking of size, they can grow up to be around 3 feet long, with the females being much bigger than their male counterparts. Good luck sleeping tonight with the image of this fish ingrained in your head. Number 2. Sloan's Viperfish now, just because this fish is less than a foot long doesn't mean it's any less scary than the rest of the creatures on today's list. You see, Sloan's viperfish can eat creatures 20 to 50% larger than itself. And how does it do that? Well, it unhinges its skull and opens its jaws at 90 degrees to swallow its prey whole. But how does it even attract its prey? Well, thanks to the photophores on its belly that produce light in the twilight zone, it doesn't have to look too hard to find its next meal. Number 1. The Goblin Shark Now we have to tell you about the Goblin Shark. You see, because of its prehistoric appearance, it's also been called a living fossil. But you know what's the most terrifying thing about these sharks? They can literally detach their whole mouth and project it forward to catch their prey, then retract it back into place. Another thing that gives us the creeps is how you can see its blood vessels through its translucent skin. They can grow up to be around 11 feet in length and live around 3,000 feet under the sea all over the world. So should we be scared for our lives from these jaws? Well, humans aren't really on their menu, as they're way too deep in the ocean to be a threat to you. So stick to the shallow waters. The sea is full of mysteries and even more creepy creatures we should all watch out for, some that are probably even yet to be discovered. Which one of these is going to give you nightmares? Do you agree with our list? Should we do a second part? Let us know in the comments.